Hey guys, welcome to another New Homes 101 video. Gilbert Patino and Manny Patino behind the camera. We're here in Las Cruces, New Mexico in a very beautiful home and the uh, very foothill of the mountains, which is very nice. Um, this is a, a 5,000 square foot home, so it's a little bit over 5,000 square feet and it's a little bit over five acres in size as well. So as you can see, you have plenty of trees again and they did a good job with the landscaping three car garage and you have plenty of windows. Uh, you see the roof, concrete tile, pitched roof. So this is a three car garage? So this is a three car garage and it has, you see the windows in the front there. Uh, you, it's not your average garage, Manny. Uh, you have nine foot garage doors. Yeah, we always talk about the eight footers, but this one's a little larger so you can fit. As you can see that van they have, easily fits in the garage. Easily fits in the garage, Manny. And then also look at the uh, coach lights. They're not your average coach lights. There's they look very luxurious, very uh, modern. Now let me show you this. You have uh, this stone path that leads to that marvelous fountain there. And the neat thing about it is that it's the New Mexico logo. Now if you can zoom in, you can see it's, it's actually the New Mexico logo in the fountain. When, when we came in. Yeah, and yeah. then you have uh, the wall of of uh, bushes there that gives you a little bit of privacy plus it makes it look a little nicer and plenty of space for RVs you can easily fit two RVs there two or more right two or more you can you fit two right next to driveway. each other and then more down the driveway if you really wanted to a lot of people move to New Mexico wanting RV space and with this you have it yep you have plenty of space parking on both sides and then I mean look at the size of this huge pillars on, on both sides and then plenty of windows as well. The design is, is amazing. Now, so check this out, man. You have the, the uh, privacy glass with the design. Makes it look very nice and very uh, high class. It's very similar to the door I have at my house. Mm -hmm. And I can tell you I love it. Nobody can see inside and you can see a little bit to the outside and yet it allows for the light to come into your house. Yeah, plenty of lighting as well. And then also with the windows, they have a slight tint to them. So you can actually have a little more privacy. Uh, and now let's, let's head, head on inside, Manny. So just to mention, the uh, owners still occupy the residence. So I wanna be mindful of that. So nice uh, entertainment area as you walk in. Big pool table fits here, no problem. Big pool table, and then I mean, look at the the views from this uh, from this room, Manny. I'll show a little bit of the views because we're gonna go outside and show people what this home has. Oh man, I can't wait to show you guys the backyard. I mean, you're gonna get a glimpse of it, but I don't want to ruin it. It has a, a lot. Little bit, little yeah, bit of the lot. pool. Yeah, it's amazing. So a fireplace, uh, plenty of lighting, and then. You can see the ceiling has a has uh, very beautiful design to, to it as well. The pillars in the front add character to it. We usually don't do the primary bedroom first, yeah. but let's do that. There's so much to cover here. Yeah, let's there, do the primary bedroom, let's do the front bedroom, and then we'll go back to the, to the other bedrooms yeah. in the backyard. It's a huge home, over 5,000 square feet. It's gonna be hard to cover everything so quickly. Huge entrance right off the bat. So uh, it's nice because you have this uh, double-sided uh, fireplace. Uh, you can, they have a fish tank, which is very nice. Uh, that archway makes the house look very uh, elegant, very modern. And then look at, you have your double doors, access to the outside right off of the master bedroom. Yeah, you can go from your bedroom to the pool right yeah, away. You can go from here. And then look at the shutters. They, they just add character to the home. They make it look, again, very nice. That patio is gigantic. Oh yeah. I just, I can't wait to show that to everybody. It's, it's one of the nicest homes in Las Cruces. A lot of people ask, hey, do they have big homes on big pieces of land? Can I get something with an RV space? Uh, is, is it going to cost me $10 million? Well, no, it's not. This home is around $2 million. Yeah, and then you, and you see that I've gotten people asking me uh, questions about sizes of the homes and why they aren't as expensive as they should be. Well, in New Mexico, here in Las Cruces specifically, you're gonna get homes that are a lot cheaper uh, than if, if they were in New York or California. Let's check out uh, the primary bathroom. Um, 
So look at that huge shower. So the nice thing about it is that they did the, the pattern here is the Oregon Mountains. So that's mosaic. That and is it mosaic. Extends, gosh, that's got to be seven or eight feet, Gilbert. Yeah, it is. From one side to the other. No more. And then you have your rain, uh, rain shower head here. Plenty of lighting coming in. You have plenty of lighting with the, uh, the decorative privacy glass as well. The bathtub with the ceramic tile lay. So it's a jetted tub. You have steps to go into it. You have steps to put your wine. A lot and of stuff. You have windows there too as well. So you have your vanity on this side. That's a very well designed, very well laid out vanity. And you have the uh, primary closet with the his and her space. And this plenty, of, plenty of lighting. You got a skylight, privacy uh, glass windows, and plenty of lights as well. And then you have your closet in the closet and an ironing, uh, ironing board as well. Uh, I wish they have ironing boards in the new homes too. Yeah, you, you don't see it that often, which is interesting. Uh, I don't know, maybe a lot of people don't uh, iron anymore, but look at this uh, pocket door. I don't think I've, you know, I've seen that many here. The ceiling here is nice, it's amazing. And then we have another bedroom here. You're gonna see closets and, and um, everywhere, right? everywhere, all around the house. What's neat about this bedroom is you have office space, built-in shelves, and then you have this uh, storage space here, uh, which you can also sit down in, and you know, plenty of seating space. And this is nice, you have plenty of lighting here in the, uh, in the shelving area, of course. And I think every bedroom has a bathroom. That's right. And then you have another bathroom that's outside that's made for the pool. Yep. So. so you have a pool bathroom and then every room in the home is gonna have its own bathroom. That Let's head great. out and check out the rest of the home. Very elegant, Gilbert. Very elegant, very, you know, everything is very high quality. Again, the office space, you have a, a very high ceiling office this space. Has, this has to be at least 16 feet. And the design is beautiful. Yeah, the designs of all the ceilings are amazing. So it's a nice office space right in the front of your house. Good office space. And then right next to the, the room as well. So we can, this is your guest bathroom? Yeah, this is going to be the guest bathroom. It's going to be that half bath. And a door to the outside? Door to the outside. Now, when they built this home, they built it with the idea in mind that they wanted views everywhere. They wanted mountain views in every bedroom if possible. So that you're gonna see that in pretty much all the rooms. You have another uh, closet here. Uh, that's entry to the garage. You have a little bit of another tech table right there. So let's, let's look at the other uh, bedrooms before we go into the kitchen, Gilbert. Yeah, let's look at the other bedrooms. So another neat thing is you're gonna have lighting in all the ha hallways throughout the home, a laundry chute, and the ceilings are pretty high here, man. Yeah, I would say 10 feet. Yeah, nichos. I, I know I didn't mention the one we just passed, but they have another nicho here. So there's three bedrooms here, and each bedroom has a bathroom. That's correct. And again, the, the shutters, you're gonna see them in every bedroom with the crank window, which is nice. I, I love this style of window, but you don't see it that often anymore. I don't know if you know they discontinued it or you just don't see it that much. Closet Again, over there. And that's another thing about these bedrooms, they all have their, their own walk-in closet as well. Another bathroom, of course. It's a very good sized bathroom. It's a full full bath, full yeah. baths everywhere. With a built-in uh, linen space as well. I'd love to be a guest here. <laughs> You'd feel like you're on a vacation, that's for sure. You got two bedrooms again. This one's amazing. This is probably one of the nice be bedrooms with the nicest views. Uh, you got views, views everywhere. Views. Every window has views. Another bathroom. Uh, again, with the built-in uh, linen space, high ceilings, the decoration uh, from the tile and, and the decor is amazing. Also a walk-in closet. Another walk-in closet with the uh, privacy glass. And then did you see the, the wood floors are, are such a neat feature? Yep, and that's actual uh, real wood. These are real wood floors. So that's amazing. Again, another bathroom. And then a full, a full uh, closet as well. And another closet, again, mountain views, amazing. 
And like you said, it'd be really nice to be a guest in this home. Let's come in through the kitchen, Manny, so we can show them the, the huge kitchen. The size of this kitchen is insane. Did you see the wine racks here? So yeah, you have a wine rack, you have uh, cabinets, drawers, doors, all throughout the home. Plenty of space. You know, it's hard to shoot a video of this kitchen because it's so large. I can't even tell you what angle to take. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is. So you have obviously everything you need in this kitchen. You have your dishwasher. You have um, the oven over here. I don't know if you can uh, come and, and, and look at this, but this is, uh, this is neat. It's a microwave oven with a heating rack as well, which is nice. Uh, you don't see that very often. It's just perfect for for cooking. If you're a cook, this is a home for you. Uh, plenty of, or you have very nice designs in the tile, in the backsplash. And then the cabinets are amazing. The way they designed this home was, was perfect. So this home is all custom. The cabinets are for sure custom. Everything you see is custom made. This is not your regular cookie cutter home. Yeah, it's not. And it's got everything a ton of wood. Everything is custom, real wood. You got a fan here in the kitchen, which is nice. Uh, Sometimes it's it's something that you you really need. Again, uh, you have two ovens. I know a lot of the times you see the the microwave oven, but this one actually has the uh, heat warmer on the bottom as well. So many ovens. So many a lot ovens. Of ovens. Yeah, a lot if of you're everything. a cook or you're you're a baker, this is a perfect home. So this here is the dining room. So this would be a dining room, and then uh, you could do a breakfast, uh, breakfast bar as well there. So good space in the dining room as well. Plenty of lighting. Yep, yeah, plenty of lighting, and then plenty of built-in cabinets, which is amazing as well. Look at the nichos all throughout the entertainment area. You have nichos all around with their own lighting, the built-in cabinets, amazing. They did a good job with that. And then the fireplace is beautiful as well. And then look at the pattern on, on the uh, tile. Uh, this this is not your normal cookie cutter house, like you said, Manny. Yeah, this is it's something amazing. you're not gonna see. I mean, the home is, I believe, from 2005. Yeah. And I can tell when they built it, they really paid attention to detail. They knew what they wanted. The, built, the owner built it for himself. Yeah, yeah, they had you know, an idea of what they were going to build and they did exactly that. Plenty of lighting in the kitchen as well. well. Let's go check out the outside. Let's check out the outside. So we're now at the backyard of the home, Annie. You have a lot of space here on the back side, on the side yard of the home. And then yeah, you can fit a jacuzzi, a hot tub. You have plenty of space here. A huge, huge uh, patio here. That's the biggest patio I've seen, Gilbert. Yeah, and look at the design on there. The pillars, uh, the, the arches, it just makes it look very luxurious and sophisticated. Very interesting. Got plenty of space for hammocks, uh, playing ex exercise. They have a grill back there. And then plenty of entrances as well. You have several doors that lead to the backyard. And uh, the design in the backyard is amazing. You got plenty of plants, the palm trees, which makes it look uh, very tropical. And then the size of this pool is, it's huge. It's huge and then they have amazing layout, and amazing design, the rocks, uh, the rocks in the slide as well. So now, the we, they don't has, have- Has also a bar and a, I mean, it's it's a complete pool. This is like being in Cancun. It is. You have the slide, the, the uh, built-in jacuzzi and the uh, bar inside of the pool, which is amazing. You I can be making drinks back there and then you can come and finish them here. I mean, you can go down the slide, enjoy the mountain view. Now, if you have a big family or you love entertaining people, this is a house for you. There's amazing palm trees. I mean, it looks incredible. Now, let's let me show you this mini bar slash kitchen but there's nothing mini about it. I mean, it's huge. You got plenty of space for plenty of stools. So you can have a huge party back here and it would be awesome. And yeah, an ice cream machine. Uh, you have your grill, built-in grill with its own vent, which is amazing as well. And then look at the ceiling in here, Manny. It's solid wood. You see the amount of lights? Yeah. I can't even count those. Yeah, plenty of lights. 
and you can have a really good time here at night just with the amazing lighting. Uh, so no backyard neighbors? Um, no it's, backyard it's a, neighbors, Manny, but yeah, it's a I big mean, enough. again, I, like I mentioned earlier, you're in the very foothill of the mountains and the views here are amazing. So plenty of space to play football or have, you know, a fun time with the family. And uh, I just couldn't wait to show you guys this home. It is amazing. Uh, also, you have a bathroom here in the back uh, for, with the shower for if you're having a party, you're gonna have uh, friends or family over after the pool, you need a shower. That's where to go. But thank you guys for joining us in this video. Uh, if you have any questions, please comment down below. If you want to see videos of anything in particular, please comment down below. Thank you.